Good morning Year 4, this is my hints and tips video for our maths lesson today, comparing area. So we'll just remind ourselves what um, area is, okay. So we know that area is the space inside a shape and if we want to be really mathematically correct we say a 2D shape because that means it's a flat shape. And building on from our previous lessons this week, um, this question, how do you work out the area of a square or rectangle? So to work out the area of a square or a rectangle, you can multiply the length by the width. So here my length is five centimeters and my width is five centimeters as well because it's a square. So five times five is 25. Okay, and this is centimeters but because it's not a straight line, it's the space inside the shape. So we made up of 25 square centimetres. And I need to show you that it's a measurement not only of length, but of width as well. So I put a small 2 to show that it's measured in two dimensions, the length and the width. I'm going to do the same for the rectangle, so my length is 7 and I'm going to multiply by 3, which is going to give me 21 centimetres, but this is a measurement of area, so it's the length and the width, so 21 centimetres squared. So here is today's white rose worksheet comparing area and it's um, very simple uh, for page the first page. Okay, so just make sure you read the question and work systematically. I just realised I'm giving you the answers. <laughs> And now for the second page, without the answers, okay, so uh, you just need to make sure you read the question, be accurate in your counting, so you can put the numbers in to make sure you don't miss any out, so you calculate the area and then draw a different shape with an area that is two squares larger. And here it says number five, put these letter shapes in order of size. Start with the shape that start with the shape with the smallest area. So we've got H, C, and O. And if O had the smallest area, we would write our O here, right? Which it doesn't. So you'll need to make sure you calculate the area of each shape. You could write it above and then list which one has the smallest area first. And here we have question six. It's not hard, but it does have a lot of information to read and think about. Okay. So here are plans of two school fields. Each has a playing field and a vegetable patch. So this is High Street School and this is Main Street School. And the first part says 
what is the difference in the area of the two playing fields and the playing fields are the parts that are marked in green because the vegetable patch is marked in brown on both schools so you need to work out the area and see whether there is a difference you do that by counting the squares okay so be systematic all the way through then have the question what is the difference in the area of the vegetable patches so the difference in area of the vegetable patches is how many squares so we need to compare how many squares this vegetable patch is and how many squares this vegetable patch is and write down the value of the difference okay. and here this is our last question which says high street school doubles the size of its vegetable patch Main Road School adds one square to its vegetable patch. Which school now has the larger vegetable patch and show your working? Okay, so let's look at High Street School doubles the size of its vegetable patch. So if we go up here, you might want to think, well, at the moment it's one, two, three, four squares. So if each square is doubled, okay, so you might choose to get a brown pencil and show how that works. All right, and then back down here, whoop, it says main road school adds one square to its vegetable patch. So adds one you could do that in brown if you like okay and then you should be able to calculate the new area for each school of their vegetable patch which school now has the larger vegetable patch and then underneath it says show your working so if you have this Sorted, um, then that will be fine and you need to make sure that you actually answer the question either high street school or main street school will have the larger vegetable patch okay uh, enjoy the area lesson today and work hard have fun I look forward to seeing um, your work later on today.